Bye. Hi, Riz. You look radiant. Ready for 42 questions with us? I think. Come on. All right. Let's begin. What is the first thing you thought of this morning? Mm. Pain. What is the first thing on your to-do list today? Mm. Ah, today I must go to gallery. Watch out, guys. What is the last thing that you purchased? Hmm. Yeah, fruit. Do you have something that you could not live without? My diary. All right. What is your go-to breakfast? Here. And what do you eat in the morning? Just egg and bread and fruit. All right. Coffee or tea? Tea. Serge Gainsbourg or Jeanne Berkin? Jeanne Berkin. I love her too. Riz, if you were to choose an artist to take out for dinner, who would it be and why? I think Monique Gliani. What is your favorite art movement and why? Let's focus is uh, the Matisse movement. It's mean the wild beast. Picasso or Matisse? Mm, wait, Matisse. Gentle and sweet, knocks me off my feet every time I see him. Handsome. My baby. What's your cat name? Oh, it's Matisse too. <laughs> Fair enough. How would Matisse describe himself if he could? Crazy. <laughs> How would he describe you? Clumsy. I'm clumsy. Oh, a single bed. Does it match your love life? I think yeah. <laughs> Would you consider yourself to be a routine person? Yeah. What is the best time for you to paint? Hmm. At nine, I think it's the morning. It's perfect for me to paint. And where do you feel the most inspired? Bali. Who inspire you the most? My mother. What inspire you the most? Animal. What was your first painting about? Oh, but wait. About that. Oh, because your next show at the Medium in December is about celebrating life. Interesting. Oh, yeah. Riz, painting or sculpture? Uh, painting. Come on, I want to see this. Well, we can see that women are a major figure on your paintings, so we are curious, well, I am. What quality are required to be your muse? I think a strong character. Who would you dream to paint or shape? Maria Magdalena. <laughs> it's quite unique. We can see tons of animals in most of your artworks, so what animal would represent you the best? Chameleon, yeah. I paint chameleon too. On a scale to 1 to 10, how spiritual are you? Hmm. Minus 1, I think. <laughs> Just curious, are you taking any drugs? Music is my drugs. Well, we have been seeing you cheering wine on many occasions. Do you always paint with a glass of wine? Yeah. Wineness or madness? Of course. We need Roman in our madness. Okay, are you cooking something? Oh, what yeah. it is? I'm dead. What do you love the most about pastel tones? Hmm. Pastel for me is not a color but about a feeling and emotion. I see, so more about emotions. Is sustainability a major value of your art process? Yeah. Are you making your own color? Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm making color. This one is from the rock. 
That's terrific. You have been painting for 20 years now. Is there any time you thought of quitting? Never. What was your favorite show exhibition so far? Mm. In Berlin. Bandung or Bali? Mm, Bandung. What do you miss the most about Bandung? My home and my mother. What is the last country you visited? Oh, Germany. What is the next one? Uh, I'm excited in New York next year. Awesome. New York and London. That's terrific. Chris, what would the world look like without art? Hmm, a little bit empty. What would your world look like without art? I think dark. Do you value digital art as much as physical art? I think no. Last question, Riz. Anything secret you love to share? I cannot paint without music. That's a great one. So, red or white? Mmm, red. Awesome. Well, thank you. We had a very fun time with you and cheers. Cheers. Bye. 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 Bye.